I know what you're thinking. I look like a bouncer at the hair club for men. I know what you're thinking. People keep saying to me, you're over 50 years old, is that your hair? 350 bucks a month? You better believe this is what I have. My wife didn't even know first month we were dating. I was away, she called me, I miss you! I want to rip my fingers through your hair! So I mailed it to her. <laughs> so all over. Comedy on Utah. Exactly. <laughs> Look at me, folks. Utah. Tough being a New York weirdo out there. Everybody thought I was in the witness protection program. <laughs> Are they really able to hide these mafia guys out west anyway? I saw a special on this one on the TV. They give these guys the option to make a win, only changing their last name. Right? That's going to help. Hey, hey, at the moment. I'm your little neighbor. My name is Mario. That's my wife, Angelina. That's my daughter, Conchetta. Here's my little son, Nunzio. We are the Wilsons. <laughs> 54 and an ounce sucks. In 50, what happens when you're 50? You look back, think back to when I was 20. Drinking age was 18 then. Remember that? We were 18, drinking legal every night! It's 50, you know what happens. I'm lactose intolerant now. Can't have dairy anymore, no more dairy for me. And on top of it, I'm getting arthritis. I went to the doctor, you know what he prescribed for me? Marijuana. He got a kick in the head. When I was a kid, my parents used to tell me, drink your milk, don't do drugs. Now I'm over 50, I can't drink milk, and I got a good drink. I said, look, I know for nothing, Doc, I'm getting old, I don't know where to get pot anymore. He says to me, don't worry, Eric, it's coming up to your health insurance. I said, great, now all I gotta do is find a drug dealer that takes Blue Cross Blue Shield. Weird. Not only is it weird that you get it old, you watch the cultural icons you remember as a kid get old too. Anybody see that ad they got now? Henry Winkler. The Fonz is doing commercials for reverse mortgages. Now. The Fonz is an old guy now. He went from A to A. people don't even know what I'm talking about. Get old. You're gonna be in for a real awakening, my young friends. One day you're gonna turn on the TV. There's gonna be a commercial. Lady Gaga with the pens. <laughs> my pants. I was born this way. Wait. In the end, I just don't want to get old people smell. That's all I care about. Uh, everybody here knows somebody in their family when old people smell. And if you're going, hey, there's nobody in my family like that, then it's you. <laughs> People tell me, you know, stop complaining already about getting your age. What do you expect? Your body changes. I got these molds. I got the Italian freckles, the molds. Anybody got molds? Let me taste them. I found out they get bigger as you get older. You should see me naked. I look like a chocolate chip cookie. <laughs> Stop complaining, embrace your age. Okay, in that case, I say we have a middle-aged pride parade. <laughs> Why not? Every other group's allowed to have one. We can show what we're going through. Okay? Have a humongous gallbladder floating down the street. <laughs> have a giant ear with hair growing out of it. Going down Fifth Avenue. Ladies, you can have a menopause for it. A giant picture of my wife growing a mustache. Women dressed as dying ovaries, waving the bar. <laughs> Guys, we can have a low testosterone countdown. Like New Year's Eve, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, 0! Happy infertility! I got man boobs, no hormone. Congratulations, I am now my own grandmother.
married, you got married people out there. You're married, I give you credit. I take my hair off to you, I really do. It's tough, go to marriage. Don't go to marriage counseling, guys. Please, my wife tried to divorce me in counseling. I told hey, I'm not intimidated. You leave me, I ain't gonna be single for long. But there's plenty of women out there looking to become citizens. <laughs> Therapist tried to give us advice. You know, she told us to do to spice up the love life. She told us to do, go to bed naked. I told the lady, after 50, that could be a deterrent. <laughs> told my wife, buy sexy lingerie. My wife comes home with an orange thong. Who buys an orange one? I told me, you look like a hooker from Home Depot. <laughs> Magic marker, wow. <laughs> I just talk to get older. I'm a, I'm a parent. I adopted my stepdaughter. Thank you, thank you. And adoption counts. You can do it on TV, either, right? Ever see those ads for the kids in South America? The guy from the country comes out? For the mere price of a cup of coffee a day. You know what You notice those people in those countries, they never adopt our kids. <laughs> See, they don't have an aid in Bolivia. Four mere seven hundred and fifty thousand dollars. <laughs> or more money than you make in your whole freaking Bolivian life. You can raise little New York Jimmy through college. <laughs> you want progress? We'll send you a video. Watch him as he sleeps till noon. <laughs> Eats you out of house and home. Watch him download porno. These kids today are crazy. High school age, they almost on the high school now, they curse at the teacher. They yell at the teacher. Were we able to do that when we were kids? Are you kidding? I was in third grade. My teacher called me an idiot, a moron. And I was homeschooled. Control. My wife and I drove past my high school. We saw a girl. Couldn't have been older than 15. She had her shirt unbuttoned. She had a birth control patch. It was showing over here. My wife went nuts. It's the parents today. Where was her mother when she was growing up? Where was the father when she was growing up? I'm like, screw that. Where was she when I was growing up? <laughs> He was the fire marshal. 